catchphrase in this part of town is, a freaking mess. <laughs> My name is Season. How you doing? How you doing, Season? <laughs> We're trying to check out season seasons. Hi, I always forget you're supposed to chill rose. I'm new money. Um, it's sound divish. Mariah Carey? <laughs> now, you know, based on New Year's Eve, she knows how to chill some champagne. <laughs> Personally speaking, I think uh, Mariah needs a basket full of cats. Because. <laughs> because until she changes her tune or finds the right man to put up with that, she will be the ultimate cat lady. <laughs> and don't throw tomatoes at me. Up next, we have some unbelievable discounts. <laughs> There's a bulb spot. My name is Sarah Lee. I'm from New Jersey. How you doing? I'm, I'm doing well, Sarah Lee. Just like the cake. Mm. <laughs> they broke up after he did that movie where he ate the fava beans. Silence of a, a foodie always remembers the food. Fava beans. We know that you're a vegan, so we made a, yeah. a vegan crab cake for you. Is that you. what this is? Yes. All right, talk okay. about how you make it, and I'm just gonna um, eat it. Okay. <laughs> and just because I don't want to talk with my mouth full, I'm holding on for one second. Why, we talk with the mouth full here all the time. Okay, fine. Don't we? And you hate it. Oh, well. Ah. Mm. Laugh with me or laugh at me, I don't care. I called you dear. I had no idea you're dressed as an old woman who would call someone dear. Yes, dear. <laughs> oh, these are the light pictures, dears. Sorry, I don't mean to call you dears. If you don't look good, we don't look good. Yes. yes. <laughs> We're getting older and older. <laughs> I'll tell you, though, with each birthday, it gets a little more difficult to pull these hours. <laughs> Everybody's a blogger or a model these days. I have no idea what that means, but everybody <laughs> do it. <laughs> I am huddled in a corner in my chair right now, like... <gasps> It'd be nice if other people would suffer along with me, though, and not wear, like, down vests. <laughs> and cashmere sweaters. <laughs> you. <laughs> what? More than I have on. When I wear sleeveless, you wear sleeveless. <laughs> okay? You don't want to see that. <laughs> yes. I heard somebody say yes. <laughs> Inside pockets. Yes, well, that's it. tied your, oh, your mm. weapon. Oh, <laughs> excellent. Okay. I do a weapon pocket inside of my outerwear because you're not gonna get me. Now, I, I hear that you don't, you think people are always gonna come and get you. No, the killer. Okay, the killer oh, is I, always I love the bells door. on the door. So, now, we all know Martha is, like, 71 years old. But Martha has lived. Plus, even though she has a New England accent that's affected, apparently, because she's from Jersey, like me. <laughs> Martha. Fresh eucalyptus. Now, that's fresh. Yep. But the, but the other stuff is, is fakery that you buy. Um, no, I, I know. Artificial, non-breakable, exquisite decoration. <laughs> Fake! Come on, don't act highfalutin around here. <laughs> this is the Wendy Show. We can talk real. Yeah. You know what I wish that I kept when our boy was born? I wish I kept that original blanket. I didn't get, like, I kept a lot of stuff. I still have my seclage in our freezer. <laughs> well, you know, I had to get that to hold him in because I had a weak cervix. I was on bed rest for nine months. He's a miracle. It's in a little Ziploc bag. And it says, do not eat. <laughs> <laughs> Wendy, what's good? I remember back in the day when your fabulous diva fan would come out. Hit the diva fan! <laughs> oh, Glam Squad Converge! We miss it. Do you still have it? Oh, yes. We throw nothing away here at Wendy. <laughs> Hit the Diva fan! Yes! 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 <laughs> oh, 
you will always be Miranda's doctor uh, to me. And I'm okay with that. I did five episodes in their final season. Okay. And the... <laughs> but you were so impactful. No, well, I, I received that. I received it. Oh. Nice behind, by the way. <laughs> Michael? Yeah. Your eyes match your suit. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Mm -hmm. What do you do? I mean, you, ca you can't help it that you were born hot. Your world has opened up for you. I mean, it, it, to me, it was open even before you got the Oscar, but sometimes people are late to the party yeah. of fabulousness, which is you. <laughs> we got to perform at the White House um, for a thing that was really? like with De La Soul and The Roots and Jill Scott. Yolanda Adams. They hooded out the BBD. White House. It was it was straight it was straight blackness in the White House, which is already good there. <laughs> so in the middle of everything, Rick Ross's ankle bracelet went off. Oh yeah. Okay. Well, well, that was that was another event at the White House. That okay. I, that, but but you know, all respect to Rose. It was just a time we were having a meeting, and um, yeah, the bracelet went off, and the president was like, "What's that?" And, and, <laughs> And Ro Rose was like, Rose stood up like a real man and was like, look, that's my bracelet. President was like, wow, you really keeping it real, huh? <laughs> You've got a particular style, always something interesting. I'm very, uh, I'm very proud of these shoes. Are you? Yes. Is there a story behind them? D they're expensive. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, we know Tay from now, you know, Empire. And yes, we know him from Waiting to Exhale. But Tay? <laughs> I was never in Waiting to Exhale. I mean, not Waiting to Exhale, um, the other one. It's all the same. The, yes. The, the, the other book. Yes, 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 yes. With, with I'll still got to back. Yes. yes, yes, yes. But that's not my favorite Tay Diggs movie. Obviously not. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> but what the... You know what, Chris, Chris, I had no idea they were gonna show a dusty. <laughs> right? Look, I love me some LL Cool J, Todd. How you doing, Todd? Now, you know LL Cool J is hard as <laughs> Battle of anybody you know with it. I, uh, they are gonna keep rocking double L, but rock the, yeah! yeah. One less pair of shoes for you. All right, I'll resole. <laughs> no, one's good. Two is not on our budget. This is not Oprah. Okay. So Stevie has five children with four babies' moms, yeah. and he owes over a million dollars in child whoa, support, no, allegedly. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Oh, I, this is what I came here for today. <laughs> you and Mariah Carey. Oh. Okay. No, 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 no. Once upon a time, there was an air gone by. <laughs> what happened? I mean, we spent a lot of time in the studio. Well, that's not what you told Nick Cannon. I mean, Nick We've is... got the receipts. Roll it. Oh, hold on, hold on. Hold on. That's uh -oh. nice. That's nice. But I already hit Mariah off twice. Oh. We're gonna leave it at that. Leave it to Stevie. <laughs> Let's talk about Bethany Frankel and her disgusting ex-husband. Jason allegedly sent Bethany 49 emails over 70 days and CC'd her current boyfriend, Dennis. In the emails, Jason is allegedly calling Jace, uh, Bethany ugly, old, and irrelevant. Well, in the Hot Topics meeting, people were saying, like, well, who hasn't said that before? <laughs> Not me. <laughs> oh, really? You're gonna back down now? Right. <laughs> okay. I'm scared. <laughs> okay. I'm scared. Well, walk on my side. Right. You gotta walk into a room fearlessly and own what you say. Right. <laughs> And who's that? I guessed it right away. She's from New York. Okay. People don't like her. Oh, wait, Bethany Franco. Yes! yes! 
So our Prince Harry, you know, the cute one. <laughs> Out of the two. Yeah, the bold one. <laughs> Prince Harry's girlfriend, Megan. You know, the one from Crenshaw. When we think of Crenshaw, we think of... <laughs> well, honey, we think of those two inside pockets that I put in my Wendy coat. Yeah, like, you might, you might need a little something. <laughs> and there's Megan. Oh, yes, she's half black and half white. But I know that she was once married. So, in other words, the prince is marrying a black divorcee? <laughs> yes, we can! <laughs> okay, Megan's family, you ready for the rest? Yeah. Dad is a former cinematographer who now lives in Mexico. He declared bankruptcy in June. They are about to hood out the palace. <laughs> and Prince Charles, you keep your trap shut. <laughs> you, let, you let your son date who he wants on account of how you treated Di. <laughs> we are on Megan's side. Yes, yes we can. All right. <laughs> Jocelyn, all you have to do is this. Are you ready? Yes. And the rest of you all in her situation. <laughs> I know my crowd. <laughs> <laughs> so we all know Ocean's Eleven, correct? Yes. Okay, well, now they're making an all-girls version of Ocean's Eight. Anne Hathaway and Kate Blanchett are in this. Reportedly, they are going to blows. They don't speak on the set. And Rihanna is in it, too. Yeah. Let me tell you something, um, Anne. You approach Rihanna with the attitude and see where it's gonna get you. Okay? Madonna. Madonna, you are so entertaining. <laughs> I don't know. There's guys in the audience. If you can't put it all the way in the air, <laughs> then don't take the picture. Lindsay has a new accent. Take a look. There's a line of where we can make happiness and show the light of every situation that is bad and make it good. So I want Lohan to be a celebration of everybody coming together. Bye, girl. Goodbye. There are some people who are really good at the payoff game. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm good at the payoff game. <laughs> Pay me off for something. You won't hear a peep from me forever. Okay? Working is for suckers. <laughs> if I could just lay home and moisturize all day <laughs> and go to the mailbox for my payoff check <laughs> and leave the house you know, at noon every day and get with my girl gang holding court in the banquet at a civilized restaurant. <laughs> Payoff check would be enough money for a car service, which means that I can have as many wines as I want. <laughs> you understand that caviar that I love? I'd be eating it by the scoopfuls. Oh, I'd be a good payoff chick. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, now you remember Naya. Naya was on Glee. You might not recognize her. She's, uh, well, different looking. If you look at before and after pictures, it's clear that this young woman is doing something during her lunchtime. <laughs> that involves a doctor. I'm, she doesn't, oh, really? You all, this is the same person? Naya, money well spent. Jocelyn's birthday is June 18th. And her real name is Shanelica Betancourt. And she's 39, not 29. I'm done. Let's move to Beverly Hills.